Hello and welcome back to my Craft the World Let's Play series. Where in this episode I have done some stuff since the last episode off camera. And as you can see we now have 6 minutes and 50 seconds before the next monster wave. And it will be in this episode no matter how long it takes. But what I want to do really is to get these basic fortifications down over here. As you can see, I placed down some nice um, lighting stands here, so we can really see what's going to happen. Also, down here, I removed the bits from this level of the house, and then moved down and placed 10 bits actually here. And I think I will keep extending this as we get more dwarfs. Um, that's the plan, anyway. So let's take a look here. I currently have some guys collecting wood. Well, they're walking all the way back, that's fine. You know what? Let them do that. Let's take care of all these bushes and trees. And there we go. We also killed a bunch of sheep. We got some wool, I guess, and I think anyway, and some meat. Lovely. So let's get building here. So basic fortifications. I don't know what all of it does, so let's study it. All right, simple fence. What does that do? The simplest of fences slows down the enemy advance a little bit. Okay, so it doesn't harm them. It doesn't really do anything other than slow it a little bit down. What I'm really interested in are these wooden spikes. Um, wooden spikes delay and damage attacking monsters. And I have seen these in action. And if it's still the way as I have seen it, if I place down a spike here, the monsters will come over here. And then start, they will have to break it in order to continue, and when they break it, they take damage. So I definitely want some of those. Um, what are these wooden traps then? A simple trap for animals and weak monsters. Set it on paths they might walk on. So these might actually help if we place, they usually spawn over here in a portal, we might place some over here on the way. So it only it says it only works on weak monsters, so we'll have to take a look at that. Wooden cage. This wooden cage can hold some monsters for a short time, allowing dwarfs to attack them without being in danger. So we might want to make some of those and put some like over here, I think, but I actually don't know how to use them yet. And we can make some beware signs. Okay. Really what I want is these wooden spikes. So let's make I say f I'd say five, six of these, and then I want some traps as well. It's pretty easy to make, really. So let's make six of those, and I need more wood. So let's see. They usually spawn at this place, right? So I think I will put down traps all the way over here. And get rid of that tree. And can we allow ourselves to place some dirt there? Maybe, maybe not. Let's see. Yeah, we can. Good. Um, let's block that up and get this level if we can. Can we do that? No, we cannot do that, sadly. Let me chop down the tree there. Well, well, hold everything. Hold the phone. <laughs> Protect your home. Okay, good. Hold the phone, pause the action. Wait, wait, too much stuff, too much stuff handling. Ooh, new dwarf. Mixed green salad and gra glass. Okay, fine, but hold the phone. <laughs> okay. We leveled up, that's good. This is bad. Because we have five minutes before the next month, so we, we are trying to prepare ourselves and then goblins comes in and ruins everything because now they're gonna get damaged and then they have to rest but we still have straps uh, okay fine take it easy let's um let's attack it head on get out of here let's attack it straight away they do have goblins over here though so let's get these guys oh no oh no He's getting very, very, very close. Hold up. Pause section. One second. Low health. This guy here. And this guy is close to dying as well. Um, okay. 
hold up. We have a new dwarf. Blaine? Is that your name? Anyways, pick up a club and get fighting. And pause again. I will put a portal here. I really hope we won't lose anyone. We are actually in kind of a problem here. Um, some of us is running for our lives. Wait, hold up. Our archer guy over here is pretty low. You know what, let's get our archers to use um, fire arrows. Let's do that. It's for these kind of situations that we have them. Uh, got the archer, there we go. I just don't want to see anyone lost in this battle, really. I don't think we will. And let's also get rid of this ugly guy. We didn't lose anyone. Phew, that's a relief. Really. Man, that came out of nowhere. That was actually pretty difficult to, to beat. Man. Okay. Now I have to get everyone to sleep. Unbelievable. Great. Um, okay, but we got through it. We, we survived, surprisingly, actually. Um, our guys are tough. Now, before I forget, we need to make some new armor, armor for our new guy here. So let's do that real quickly. Uh, I don't know what just happened, but it switched page. Okay, and we want a helmet. It's gonna be nice when we can start doing iron armor or steel armor. I think it's cold, but I'm not sure. Let's do that and that. There we go. Okay. Let's then place that. Okay. Good. Let's get people to sleep here. Um, I will have to do that. Okay. Do that, my friend, and then go rest. Collecting resources. No, go to rest. Digging. Go to rest. Go to rest. Go, go to rest. Go to rest. Um, go to rest. Okay. I think everyone is sleeping now. What are you doing? Go to rest. Fine, cut that tree and then go to rest. Or do that, whatever. Okay, so we have some traps placed down here and here and here and... Did all that water just come from one rain day? Great. Um, yeah, I'll then place these ready to be placed once some dwarfs get up like this guy. Okay, I'll let him do that because we do really need it. Um, yeah. So what these will do is that the monsters will come here, right? Let's actually get rid of that. And then what they will have to do is to get through these, break them and take damage until they get to the other side where we will be waiting and hopefully be shooting them. Um, I don't know, should I make anything else? I don't feel like the fences are going to be any good, nor the cages. I don't actually know how to use the cage. Like if it should be up or if it should just be down or anything, I don't know. Um, you know what, I will make them just so that I have them just in case we should be using them in the future. And we completed new technology basic fortifications, which unlocked fishing and advanced construction. And yes, finally, scaffolding. Man, that has been a long time coming. A real long time. <laughs> okay, and we can do fishing now. Cool. You know what? If we get through this... 
Wait, is this supposed to take down once you're in the... Okay, I think that was just an, an error. Or not an error, a bug maybe. Anyway, we have one minute. Dude, what are you doing? <laughs> Go rest. Um, man, we are not at all ready here. Um, I'll place a trap here if anyone can actually get it done. Uh, what are these two new things? We have some a smithing book, book and a fish's book. And we also have a bunch of new stuff here in this in our inventory. Scaffolding and trap. What on earth is that? Place traps in animal habitats to catch the animals. Hmm. Wait, what unlocked that? Oh, this one, advanced construction. I have never seen that, actually. Okay, looks like everyone is getting healthy down here. So, I hope it's not going to be a problem today. Um, let's place some dirt here and... You know what? Let's place some dirt there as well. We are ticking down 55 seconds. Come on, guys, let's get our last preparations done for the day. And let's, um, they're not going to be able to put a dirt block there. Um, maybe here though. We'll see. Uh, oh, a tree in the way. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, no, don't do that. Don't, please. No. Don't. Return. <laughs> Quick. Here, use a portal. Use a portal. Okay. Um, okay, get rid of that. And let's... Pass action. Call everyone over here. Get through the portal. Thank you. And let's get rid of the portal. Okay. Everyone is gathering. Archer in front. That's good. That's not good. Whoops. Okay. Archers are set to be using fire arrows. Let's actually remove that and put it down here, I think. Where did it open? Wait, what? Oh, hold, hold the phone. Um, okay, then. I did not expect that. I thought that it would only be coming on one side and not the other one. Well, that's a huge problem, and who on earth is that? I think that's actually a catapult guy. Oh dear. Um, well, we might lose a guy. I thought they would come from this way. But, um, oh, he's shaking the ground when he's walking. And this is a scary guy. I will not attack until they are right where we can actually attack them, like here. So, wait, that guy is not even healed. Let's get him, let's get that guy, that guy, that guy, that guy, that guy. We can do this, come on. Our guys are soldiers. They're brave and hopefully we can beat them. <laughs> well, I'm very worried about this guy. Um, fall back a little bit. A little bit, guys. Okay. They're not listening. Let's attack that guy and attack this guy. Focus all your firepower on this guy. Before he gets up and can do, do some really big damage with this weird thing. They're using fire arrows, but it's not doing a lot. I think maybe they're because they're firing the water. And it actually looks like he's stuck. So he aren't doing anything. Wonder if that's a game bug or what. But you know what? Let's, um, we... Wait, what, is it? what are they doing? You know what? That's up for the archers then. Have the archers have some fun. <laughs> I think we have used all of our fire arrows actually. We're under attack. Where? Kill that guy. 
and get the ghost. I really want to see when this guy dies. Come on. It's a bit cheaty, I guess, but you know what? If he keeps slipping, that's fine with me. <laughs> we got him. And I think... Yes. I think we defeated it. No one left? Yeah, we did. That was very, very easy. But we learned something, which is not to underestimate that the portals can come from different areas. Um, wow. I didn't actually think it would come from this side. Well... Okay, have fun, zombie. Okay, well, we have a little bit of time left over, so let's prep this area over here, and let's Actually, you know what, since we got through it all, both Goblin Invasion and Monster Wave, let's do some fishing. And let us do that. I think we just need a fishing rod and then they can fish. We will have to see. Let's do that. And we also got a bucket of worms. Increases the efficiency of the fisher skill and the float. What does that do? Increase the efficiency of the swimmer skill and let's just take a look here fishing we can make fish stew, grilled fish bucket of worms and float You know what? Let's um, Let's do fishing Yeah, let's do fishing Hopefully someone will go ahead and fish and let's put a dirt right there and let's put a dirt right there And now I can actually remove that and get rid of that Okay we actually got through it all. Amazing. Let's do that. And well, we got an ant nest over here, which I don't think we will be doing today. I think our dwarves need some vacation time, which is why we're gonna fish. Um, the only problem is that it spawns over here, the portal. Ah, he's fishing. <laughs> the only problem is that he, the portal will spawn over here. Which means we can't get a flat battleground here. Unless we put some... Yay, he caught a fish. Unless we put some stone here, which I actually will do. Just to extend the ground that we can battle on. So, or fight on. Um, so we can have at least a few traps here. And once we get to the point, we can have some turrets up here. That's a lot of XP. Wow. But we got a steel club and a wooden wall. That's nice. Um, so yeah, we won't be able to have that as many um, fortifications as before. But as over here, I mean. But um, should be doable, really. I hope. Okay, I really want that done. So please do it. <laughs> uh, cut down. There we go, see? Doable, if you really want to. And, wow, a lot more trees over here. I will actually go ahead and do that. And let's get the animals, cut down, cut down, cut down, cut down, cut down, cut down. Yes, and cut this down and get that as well. We can also set up farm stuff later, I think. Like for wheat and we can make, I think it's bread. And cut down and let's put down some more traps over here and You know what let's extend this a little bit so like over here and let us then Hmm Have these so I want one there and then one here. I think for now anyway Okay, um, so did we get fish Wait, what's this? Skeleton's saber and we have a goblin spear It's not as good as our clubs but except for the spear um, I don't know if we can use it for anything else, but we'll keep it and What can we make in the food area? Oh, we got windows Okay, hold that thought um, 
I just want to make some fish food here. We got fish. Let's see what can, what we can make here. Okay, so we can make grilled fish and we can make fish stew. Let's make a bit of both. So for the grilled fish, we need oil, uh, which we don't have that much of. We need the fish, obviously, and we need some coal. And let's make 10 of those. Um, how is it to make oil again? It's berries, stone for some weird reason, maybe to crush them, I don't know. And then some bottles, so let's make a few of that. And let's make some fish stew. Oh, that takes a lot of fish. That takes fish and water and some leaves and then two pieces of coal. But it does make 15, so let's make two of that and let's keep fishing actually. Um, let's place that and let's keep fishing let's get one more fish I think and let's also make um, a few more wooden traps and also let's go back here wooden spikes let's get some of that as well for the other place um, and I want to see here uh, where is it? <laughs> I'm looking there. The turrets aren't that far away, actually. Right here, which we can then put up somewhere and it will shoot at the enemies coming. So they're cooking. Again, throwing the food on the floor. Just great. All right. So we got an extra fish there. Just going to wait for someone to pick it up. Let's put a trap down here. And you know what? Let's do it here as well. And I kind of want to move that to a better location. Where are they? There they are. So like here, I think, instead. And then place down these there. Just to give a bit of protection, I think. And yeah, I think that will do. Oh, we caught a puffer fish. Isn't that what it is? Yeah, puffer fish, I think. And let's put that there. And yes, I haven't forgot the round windows. Let's see. Let's get rid of. Let's get rid of these. And let's see the round windows. Where are they? Uh, can't find them now. There, round windows. So it just takes some wood and some glass. My guess is that they need to be made in a workstation. Actually, I don't think so. Okay. They have to be made in a workstation. Let's just see. How many can we fit here? Hmm. We can fit quite a few. I think I will put one over here. So that's one. And maybe let's make... Let's make four. You know what? Let's make four of them. So... That's the wood. And then the glass let's make three four let's make four of those and let's also while we can make the scaffolding because that is something that is really annoying me when i build they have to be made at a workstation as well that's fine and this trap is actually very increasing what is this wooden bridge um this, this simple yet sufficiently durable and quick to build wooden bridge will provide a reliable crossing. So, hmm, I'm thinking like over here, but will we then still be able to fish? I don't actually know. I will make some and then we can find out later on. And then planks, we gotta get more planks made here. Let's get that going as well in the workshop. I think we gotta get a workshop more, wooden workshop. So I will have to extend this, maybe in the next episode we will do it, extend this up. So we can build more stuff. And we have 17 coins, that's nice. Um, I just want to see real quick, what takes, what does a trap take to make uh, uh grain it takes grain leaves i just want to try it out so let's see what it really does and then that and then luck 
Okay, that has to be made in this place as well. Can we make another one of those as one of the final things? Uh, kind of hard for me to find stuff here. Uh, where is it? There, workbench. It's just iron ore and wood. We even have a table. That's nice. So let's get that done and let's see. Can we squeeze one through there? No, we cannot. Um, but I think if we remove this, we can remove cooking campfire because then we can place one over here. And which means, where is it? Cooking campfire, where are you? There. Because then I can place it, I think there's space over here. I hope there's anyway. Over here, not enough, not, not enough resources in the stockpile, there soon will be. And let's go. Yes. And then I think this can be placed here. So we got an extra woodworking station. And I don't know, did the windows complete? We got one window. Let's place down one window and call it an episode. Now oh, that's nice. Every, every, yeah, every bit is taken. I think I will extend it in this direction, actually. Maybe extend this as well further out and then extend this too and yeah get oh we cannot get through that right i forgot that uh dwarf don't walk too far away with that because you'll need it now yeah it's okay um let's put a window above the chair right here let's get it looking very nice and then i will call it an episode so we will put one window in. We will also put some windows here, I guess. So let's put a window there. And I think that will add to the comfort level. Uh, yeah, don't worry, don't worry. And please update. Update. There we go, back at 50%. I think they do add some comfort level. Um, let's add another one over here. Why not? And... I'll probably find a way to add them like, what's it called? I can't remember what it's called, but like, maybe the way I made the, the torches, like it's the same everywhere, I might do that with these windows as well. But, hey, they're there now. So, yeah, a pretty good episode. We got surprised, surprise attacked by goblins. We, um, we survived that and we survived. The third, I believe it was, monster wave um, attacking from an unexpected angle or side. And we survived that as well, even with a big catapult guy thing. I think that was pretty good. Um, so yeah, if you enjoyed this episode, remember to leave a like, comment and share it with your friends. And if you are new to the channel, remember to subscribe. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed and I hope to see you next time where we hopefully are going to be doing some more technology tree advancing and also um, building, I think, because I want another layer of this. So hopefully we'll do that in the next episode. All right, have a nice day. Bye-bye. Angry Bird, hello. Uh, goodbye, Angry Bird, I guess. <laughs>